Hey, welcome to another one. Cheap Ultrabook and a fancy game video. We will be playing Metro Exodus today. Just making sure we are on extreme graphic settings and all effects are turned on. By the way, I'm running the latest GeForce Now version, which includes 120 FPS support now. So let's see how that works. And this shooter is a perfect test subject to test how smooth and responsive cloud gaming can be. And it looks like as if the game is running locally so far. Yeah, I'm impressed. Extremely smooth gameplay. Just like the game would be running on this notebook locally. Except it's running on Nvidia server several hundred kilometers away. And we can connect external monitor, run the game on the higher resolutions now. Sadly, GeForce Now still does not offer ultra wide support, so we have these black bars. And here are some more of the game footage captured straight from the desktop. Again, 1080p, extreme graphics settings. Funny, but Nvidia still haven't upgraded GeForce now with RTX technology, so everything is on extreme settings, but no RTX. Look, maybe you should come back to the order. We'll move to Polis. Dad says he'll arrange a flat for us. Because if not us, then who? A flat with a kitchen and a shower. Let's go in turns here. It's not Careful. At least it held. Well, I'd say we're out of the woods. Whoa. Hear that? Turn the light off. Did you hear that? Distracting him. Look, there's some garbage around. Throw some. Great. Now throw it. I hope the noise distracts him. Well done. Who the fuck are you? Get down! Oh. Uh. 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 
and yeah I'm more than impressed with the performance and I think I will continue Metro on a GeForce Now Cloud. It runs the game better than my desktop with the GTX 1060. And there was not a single time where I could notice that the game is running remotely through the whole hour of the gameplay. 120, 120 FPS feature puts GeForce Now to a completely new level and enables playing even a fast paced shooters like this on a cloud now. So thanks for watching, subscribe for more videos like this, hit that like button and you can find all product links in the video description below with the GeForce Battle link. I think I need to try GeForce now on my new projector. So leave a comment below if you would like to see a video about that and see you in the next one.